using the dim edit command. The dim edit command is, should not be confused with the dim t edit command. Although it does provide similar functions in the home and angle options, we have a unique option called the oblique option. It allows us to change the extension line angle of our particular drawing. Here we have a, a, a mimicked uh, stairway and we like to have six foot eight minimum headroom clearance to a stairwell and you can see it usually you know we try to measure from the top of the stairs top of the stairs type of thing so if I go up into my dimensions hit the down tab and I go over to the oblique it's the dim edit command so I can then select the dimension I'm interested in hit enter and I can key in my angle so I can key in say 45 degrees and it puts in now my you can see at this point oop, you can see how my extension lines now are stretched out and I can have them stretched out on any angle so we can have those things stretched out like such and I can then have them running across the top of the corners of the stairs type thing. So it's a great way for bleaking things. Um, that's putting things on an angle. And uh, so the command we use that is the dim edit command and that's found under the dimensions and under oblique. So it's the dim edit command.